the correct adjustment of the laser belt liner must be checked regularly. If there are any deviations, the laser belt liner must be recalibrated using the supplied aluminum rail. For this purpose, the laser and the measuring unit are attached to both ends of the mark side of the measuring rail. It is important to ensure that the laser belt liner and the measuring unit are placed on the upper side of the measuring rail. This is marked by stickers. A new calibration of the laser belt liner is necessary when the line laser no longer appears vertically or no longer appears on the center of the measuring unit. Step 1. Vertical Calibration After loosening the Torx 10 screws at the top, the entire tube of the laser is turned to the left or right until the line laser on the measuring unit forms a vertical image. Then carefully tighten the screws. Step 2. Angle Correction After loosening the two lower retaining screws, the head section of the laser belt liner can be swiveled to the left and right. By swiveling, the line laser can be absolutely centered. Then carefully tighten the screws. Note, the measuring rail must not be misused and should only be used for the calibration of the UT laser belt liner. A measuring rail that is only minimally bent will inevitably lead to an incorrect calibration. For more technical videos about the Gates carbon drive system, subscribe to our channel. Feel free to ask questions in the comments. Your team from Universal Transmissions.